now we are discussing about top and stop command how top command works and how a stop command work we we will discuss so first i want to tell you about top command so the function of top command is it catches information from multiple file and shows at one position uh, it uh, display information about uptime average load task running number of user logged in how many number of user logged in there number of cpu and cpu utilization all information about cpu are showing by top command and uh, memory and swap system process and system processes information uh, is displayed on top command so uh, first uh, we have to understand some basic command then we will understand how top command actually works so uh, if we want to see the information about memory and swap what is the command the command is free command it shows like uh, uh, how much uh, total memory is there how much used memory how much free memory and uh, shared memory how much buffer and uh, how much available memory is there so uh, and another command is w command w command shows the information about how many user are connected and it also shows about uh, ip address uh, of root so we have focus on uh, the user first so w command gives uh, information about how many user is connected then uh, uptime time command shows uh, the system uh, the system is in how many hours it uh, up uh, nearly 14 hours uh, from it up and I also give the information about load average uh, and uh, use all CPU information version and uh, let's see see here version is displayed here and processor and vendor all the information about cpu um, how many megahertz and cache size uh, look at this cache size it displayed in also in top command so load average it also displayed by uh, top command so all these basic command combined and form a top command so now we are going towards top command see here the top command and time is given here up time and uh, from when the uh, system is up are connected load average 1 10 and 15 uh, minutes a uh, task 107 total running to not not uh, 107 total tasks one running 103 sleeping three stopped zero zombie zombie means uh, one parent process we are running and it have a uh, 
some child process we stop uh, after that we stop parent process then uh, the child process uh, still running uh, it have no use uh, that that process is called zombie process uh, it also so cpu uh, percent cpu utilization a hardware interrupt and all the things uh, it shows ram uh, how much ram is there how much free and how much used how much cash it shows swap memory how much free and how much used and how much available uh, at uh, at here it show process id user pr ni word re what means um, virtual memory res means physical memory uh, cpu utilization percent cpu utilization percent memory utilization and here is the process name and commands a system defined or this process or system defined or third party both are both are showing by top command uh, this is our top command if you want to change the color of top command uh, you just press z Let's see how how it is running i want to show you one another command name is stop stop command is the advanced version of top command it shows information in graphical manner and uh, it gives some reliability reliability in top command so you can see that how h top command look like here uh, shows the core how many cores are there and how much load on that core uh, memory utilization swap memory utilization in graphical manner tasks Read, uh, how much running how much load average there uh, uptime and here processes and here are the option for seeing uh, the uh, the processes and uh, here here is the one option for killing we can directly kill process from here uh, we can see the tree if you I press on tree it shows like that the tree structure of process that's it about a stop command thank you